People with a single palmar crease have just one line running across their palm, while the majority of the world's population has two. Also called the simian crease, this feature is found only in 1.5% of the world's population. Men are more likely to have a single palmar crease than women. In most cases, it runs in families. Less than 50 people have ever had the Rh null blood type, dubbed golden blood. For the first time, this blood type was discovered in an Australian Aboriginal woman. This unique blood type is universal and can be accepted by anyone, even those with rare blood types within the Rh system. 3% of people all over the planet have lines creating the letter X on both their hands. This is a rare phenomenon, and in many cultures, this feature is believed to be a sign of a strong character. About 25% of people have an interesting reaction to sunlight. They sneeze. This phenomenon even has its own name, the photic sneeze reflex. In the Greek language, it's called sun sneezing. In some people, saliva accumulates in a gland under their tongue. Then it can get propelled out in a stream when a person presses on this gland. If the mouth is open at the moment, a jet can reach several feet. This process, called gleeking, can occur spontaneously. A person accidentally pushes their tongue against the gland while eating, yawning, talking, or cleaning their teeth, and voila! Up to 35% of people can gleek, but just 1% can do it on command. Less than 1% of the world's population has dextrocardia. That's a rare condition when the heart points toward the right side of the chest rather than the left side. Sometimes people with this unique feature have all their internal organs on the mirror image side of the body. Ocular albinism affects only a person's eyes. Their hair and skin are usually a bit lighter than that of their family members, but the difference isn't that dramatic. Albinism is a rare feature to have, but if it's ocular, that's even more unique. Experts don't have exact numbers, but they think between one person in 20,000 to one person in 50,000 have ocular albinism. You may have a tiny hole at the top of your ear where it meets the temple. If so, you're among 10% of the world's population. This hole is most commonly found on the right side, but some people have it on both of their ears. These holes may go all the way through, or they can be dimples, dents, or even small lumps. Around 65% of the world's population have loop-shaped fingerprints. In 30% of people, fingerprints are whorl-shaped, and only 5% of people have arch-shaped fingerprints. All these types are divided into smaller groups. For example, there might be plain or tented arches, accidental whorls, or peacock's eye, and so on. Hey, who knew? Most people have 12 pairs of ribs, which makes 24 in total. But 1 in 200 people has an additional 25th rib. Called cervical, it forms at the base of the neck above the collarbone. It can grow on the left, right, or even both sides. Those with extra ribs most likely know nothing about this modification. That's because an extra rib rarely forms completely and can look like a thin strand of tissue. In this case, you won't even see it on an x-ray. If you have a circular hair whirl on your head, it's likely to be clockwise. Some scientists think there's a genetic link between hair whirl direction and handedness. A bit more than 8% of right-handed people have counterclockwise hair whirls. But in the left-handed, this number grows up to 45%. When you're asked to clasp your hands, which finger do you put on top? If it's the right thumb above the left one, you're among 50% of the world's population. 49% of people position their left thumb above the right. And a mere 1% place their thumbs next to each other. Red hair occurs naturally in a mere 1-2% to of the world's population. Most often, redheads have northern or northwestern European origin. This color is caused by a genetic mutation. The hue can vary from bright copper and auburn to red-orange and strawberry blonde. Only 3-22% to of people in the world have Morton's toe. It's a foot structure when the second toe is longer than the first one. Michelangelo's David and the Statue of Liberty both have this unusual body feature. And they aren't even alive. Oops, spoiler, sorry. 
Only two people out of every 10,000 have an unusually shaped pupil. Most commonly, it resembles a keyhole. This eye disorder is called coloboma. Luckily, people with this condition don't usually have any problems with their vision. You know, on second thought, it's not so rare. All of my teachers thought I was an unusual pupil. <laughs> Having different colored eyes, heterochromia is a rare body feature that occurs in less than 1% of people. It can be complete, then a person has eyes of two different colors, for example, one brown and one blue. A person can also have a differently colored ring around the pupil. It's central heterochromia. And partial heterochromia is when a part of one iris has a different color from the rest of it. People with dystochiasis have one more row of eyelashes. This phenomenon is a genetic mutation. It's not harmful in any way, but can cause some discomfort. A hair can grow where an oil gland is supposed to be on the wet part of the eyelid. Then it causes irritation and tearing. There are people who don't have to stress over how much calcium they consume. They have a rare mutation in the LRP5 gene. It gives them mega-dense bones almost unable to break. One of the few drawbacks of this condition, such people have difficulty staying afloat while swimming. Some women have super color vision, tetrachromacy, thanks to special cells in their eyes. These cells are called cones, and a regular person has three types of them. But tetrachromats have four cones. It allows them to see 100 million different colors. The TEC2 gene lets people work more and sleep less. Nicholas Tesla, Winston Churchill, and Margaret Thatcher all had this unusual feature. The gene basically allows a person to go through their sleep cycle in less time than regular people need. Another gene mutation helps people keep their bad cholesterol levels extremely low. The gene gives your body instructions for producing a protein that controls the amount of cholesterol in your blood. Unfortunately, only 2-3% of people have this useful feature. Only 4% of people have an Audi belly button. Several factors, like the fat distribution around your waistline or genetics, determine which kind of belly button you'll end up with. Genetics play a crucial role even in your taste buds. Up to 25% of the population are super tasters. They have more visible taste papillae, those are tiny dots littering your tongue, than regular tasters. This extra option makes them more sensitive to certain foods, for example, sweet, bitter, or salty. Super tasters also have more pain receptors on their tongue. That's why they shy away from spicy food. When wisdom teeth try to break through the gums, they often run out of space and have to be taken out. Around 5 million people go through such surgery every year. But 35% of the world's population don't have to worry about pain and inconvenience. They lack wisdom teeth altogether. Long palm muscles helped our ancestors to climb trees. Even though most of us don't need this option anymore, some people are still born this way. You can check whether you have these muscles by putting your palm on a flat surface and touching your thumb to your pinky. If they do exist, they'll pop out of your wrist. Scientists claim Tibetans are genetically mutated to be able to live at such high altitudes. One of their genes is responsible for fast adapting to falling oxygen levels. The same gene is also leaked with improved endurance in athletes. By the way, it was one of the fastest evolutionary mutations ever recorded in people. It developed in less than 3,000 years. Gray eyes are an incredibly rare body feature. Only 1% of the human population are born with gray eyes. Such people have low levels of melanin in the front part of their irises. Blue eyes are also not as common as you might think. Just 8-17% to of people have them. An even rarer thing is a combination of red hair and blue eyes. If a person is born like this, it means both their parents carried these genes for a child to have.